Hannah, wake up. Come on down. We have some great news for you. Okay, Mom. Just give me a few minutes. Hannah, we have some great news. That dance contest you entered has paid off. You were selected to go to Ireland for a musical dance tour. That sounds great. I can't wait to go. Way to go, Hannah. I'll miss you while you are gone. I am the promoter for this tour. Call me Barry. You will be in charge of 20 teenage girls who have proven their dancing abilities. Now I will have both of you introduce yourselves. I am Nina and I come from Hoboken, New Jersey. I am looking forward to this tour. I live in a small town in Kansas. My name is Minnie. This will be my first time out of the country, but I am dying to learn. First you will be given a quick tour of a castle. There's a caretaker there. 
From there you will go on to the first dance. Make sure you keep track of the girls. I know how that can be. Where will we staying, the two of us and the girls? We will set you up in a series of hotels. You will be in good shape. What will be the dancing venues? Most of them will be out of doors. The girls will be getting a real education while enjoying themselves. I have not seen a more enthusiastic group. Aren't you coming with us to help manage the girls? No I am not. I have other things to do. You have my number. Call me if there are any problems. There is no one here. It's interesting, but a little sparse. We could try upstairs. He is supposed to be staying here. Hello? We are the tour group. We have 20 young dancers with us. Okay, give me a minute. Please wait back down at the tables. This place is so beautiful and warm. I could stay here for a while. I'm with you. It's like a dream come true. Let's just relax. I wonder what those ruins are for. Do any of you know the history of this place? There are some legends about this place, legends of leprechauns, banshees, and other things. I want to see the castle. I love knights in shining armor. These are really old ruins. I wonder why the castle was built close to these, or the other way around. I read that there was a big battle that destroyed an old castle. The new one was built right near it. I think this is a really spooky place. I will be glad when we get to our first dance. Hey look here. It's an old coin I think. Why don't you keep it? Put it in your pocket. There isn't that much to see here. It's an old castle that I keep up. I am sure the girls will be fascinated. We are too. At least I am. I am sure you are. Just remember that the girls must never take anything from here. There are old legends that would make this dangerous. Legends? What do you mean? There is a leprechaun that is supposed to be here, and he will take revenge. There is supposed to be an old witch of ancient legend called Karman, and I personally know of an old witch who comes around here. Fairies abound here too. Leprechauns? Witches? Fairies? Come on. We live in the modern world. You can't expect us to believe old Irish legends. You had better believe them. I have seen it for myself. We thank you for letting us look around. Come on Minnie, we have some sights to see. Well what do we have here? A full-blown leprechaun. For what do I have this pleasure? Marvin Gallagher at your service, sir. I have never met a leprechaun who was at anyone's service. So what do you want? That is a very cynical worldview, but to answer your question, I lost one of me prize coins. Have you seen it? I have more to do than worry about someone's coins. Ye had better care. I think it was one of those girls who were here who took it. They are no longer here. What do you want me to do? 
I want me coin back. I won't stop until I have it. Where did they go? I think they were going to Roscommon first. Now I have work to do. This is not my problem. Go see that old witch. Well it looks like I have some company. What does a leprechaun want with me? I need help witch. A group of girls stole me favorite coin and I want it back. A brave leprechaun like you needs help with mortal girls. How humiliating. So what do you have for me in return? A wee sack of me gold, as soon as you deliver the coin. This must be really important to you. What do you want me to do? You don't want to hurt them do you? Of course not. I won't hurt the wee lasses, just scare them into giving me coin back. Okay I will send a banshee with you and she will invade their dreams to terrorize them. Remember the rules. If any of them sees you for real, then the deal is off. You can enter their dreams and show yourself there. I wish Marvin Gallagher always follows the rules. Welcome everyone. The winners of the dance contest will be out shortly to put on a demonstration. Okay girls this is it. We are up next. I can't wait. I have been waiting so long for this. So have I, but I am scared. You'll do fine Jade. We all will. Take a deep breath Jade. It will be fun. I promise. Let's go.
So how do you all like the Ganon so far? This is our next dancing gig you know. It is kind of creepy and old but I can get used to it. Many of these towns in Ireland are like this. A mixture of old and the new. It's a nice place to visit but I wouldn't want to live here. Why? Ireland is a beautiful place. I would almost like to stay. I am feeling homesick for one thing. You may as well get used to it because we have a long ways to go. I am kind of tired. We have a big day of dancing tomorrow. I am going to lie down. Go ahead. We will head off to bed shortly.
I want me coin back. Give it to me. Loretta wake up. You are having a bad dream. Will you be okay? The dance is in the morning. I am okay, thanks. Just scared.
May I help you? We are expecting a large group. We may not have any vacancies after they come. We are the chaperones for the girls in that group. We are here to set things up. Oh good. We have set you up on the first three floors, two rooms per floor. Nina, you are in the right-hand room, first floor, and Minnie you are in the left. You will be responsible for the behavior of your students. How long did you plan to stay? Five days. There are plenty of towns around Limerick that we plan to dance at. Very good. We will set you up with keys and room service. Well this is cozy. After we get settled in maybe we could go shopping. After tomorrow's dance I mean. What do you think of this place? This city is bigger than the ones we have seen. It's a really nice city. The people are friendly. I think we could catch a movie if we hurry. There is a theater right down the street. Then we will go to bed because we have a busy schedule for the next few days. There is a horror film playing there. They might not let us in because of our age. Maybe one of our chaperones could take us.
I want me coin back. Give it back or I will give you more of this. It was a horrible dream. Wildcats of some kind attacking women and girls. And a leprechaun demanding a coin be given back. That's the same thing that Loretta told me, but her dream was about a vampire killing a woman. Do you think there is a coincidence there? Probably just because we are in Ireland. Let's go back to bed. We have a busy day tomorrow. Thank you all for coming. Today we are going to do a classic Irish reel for a first dance, and fine music for the rest of the dances.
Are you going out on the town girls? Yes Minnie we were going to go out shopping if that's okay. We wanted to take in some sights too. Okay just be careful girls. This is a strange land. Come back soon because you have a big dance tomorrow. We'll be ready Minnie. It's been fun so far. Hello, what are you? Can you understand me? I understand you completely. It should be obvious that I am a fairy. But fairies don't exist. I wonder if I am hallucinating. No you are not hallucinating. I came to warn you a leprechaun who is terrorizing your girls to get his coin back. The girls have not told me anything. I overheard a conversation between the leprechaun and a witch. He is going to give them terrifying dreams until he gets his coin back. This is too much. Fairies, leprechauns, witches? They don't exist. That's news to me. You have no idea, especially you Americans. Who is it? I am busy with company. It's Nancy. I just wanted to ask a question. Let her come in. Come on in. You have an odd taste in guests. Are you a fairy? This will take some time to explain Nancy. You need to get the coin back. He will continue to terrorize your girls, and the dreams will get worse. Nancy did one of you pick up a coin when we were at the castle? I don't know. I will ask around. Go ahead and do that. Don't tell anyone about this conversation. You have been convicted of witchcraft. You are condemned to be burned at the stake. Burn witch burn. We will burn the devil out of you. Set the witch on fire. Burn witch burn. Burn witch burn. Stop the witch. Burn her.
I want me coin back. Give it to me. I am terrified. The dreams are horrible. I wish we could get out of this place. We are all scared but the dreams cannot affect us if we don't let them. It's just that they seem so real. They are terrifying. We still have some dancing to do. Let's get up on stage. Today we are going to do a traditional Irish jig. Get ready to have a good time.
Hannah, it's good to see you. It's been a long time. I am glad to see you too. Where is Daddy? He is out of town deal making. Mom is outside getting some fresh air. This house does not look right. What do you mean, Hannah? We have always lived here.
Are you all right, Hannah? Is your family okay too? I called them thanks. They are okay. It was just a dream. Where is Nina? We were hoping that the caretaker at the castle will know how to contact the leprechaun and give him back the coin. Nina took it to him. She'll be back. I would like to see an honestly real leprechaun for myself. So would I. But remember that this leprechaun has been causing the bad dreams. I will just be glad when this is all over.
Hello, I have the missing coin that the leprechaun wants back. Sorry our girls took it. Do you know the leprechaun who it belongs to? Yes I can contact him. Thank you for bringing it back. Leave it on my table. Well I will be going. Tell the leprechaun to stop the dreams. I will tell him. I want you to stay. I can't do that. I need to get back to my girls. You are staying here. I have not fed in some time. Ye said that my coin is here. It's on the table. I just had a meal so it slowed me down. Now you stop the dreams. Marvin Gallagher makes good on his promises. The dreams will be stopped and the witch paid.
I am not looking forward to sleeping tonight. The dreams are terrible. Me neither. Nina has got to succeed. But how do you find a leprechaun? I was told that the caretaker should know where he is. I don't know how much I believe about the leprechaun story anyway. I believe it. This whole land is steeped in legend. I heard something else. A bluegrass band called the Dixie Bells are supposed to open up for us. They are from America and are supposed to be really good. That sounds great. I would love to hear them. I heard that the stage we will be using will be round. That will be a challenge. Let's get some sleep. It's a big day for us. Ah! 
Ye have returned me coin. I am lifting the curse. Pleasant dreams. <laughs> Minnie, what's wrong? Did something happen? It's Nina. She's dead. They say it was some animal that did this. Is there anything we can do? We barely even knew her. No, just put on the best show you can. <laughs> Who is it? Who is at the door? I am Patsy McGuire of the Dixie Bells. We will be opening on stage before you. Come in Patsy. Sit and be comfortable. I heard what happened. I'm sorry. How could you possibly hear about that? We don't even know you. I have connections here in Ireland. I was born here and moved to the United States. I just wanted you to know that we are here to help. Thank you. Stay in touch, will you?
What are you thinking about Patsy? I am just waiting for those two prospective students who led me here. They look pretty good to me. What happened with that? I was conducting phone interviews with them, and they told me about the castle and the dreams. I stopped by the area for a while and talked to the local folks. Did you run across the leprechaun? No. The locals don't believe that he is a leprechaun. He has a reputation as a bit of a huckster. In fact, one of the girls that I talked to told me that his precious coin was in fact a ride token. He probably left it out intentionally so that the girls would pick it up. He just wanted an excuse to torment them. So who is the witch? Is she real? Apparently so. The townsfolk tend to avoid her. They don't really care for her. It's a shame that we can't see justice done. That might happen, just a different way. Some of the locals found a spray paint can with gold paint and some lumps of iron in an old shack. The thinking is, that he paid the old witch with fake gold. I have a feeling that she knows how to handle it. Nice kitty. I will make it up to the old witch. There's no need for this. Ah!